I think, you know, relationships like we've built, you know, Jan and myself um, and, and many others in the organization really helps, you know, to having that one-on-one -on -one type conversation, to have that partnership, even a friendship, I would say, goes way beyond everything else, right? It really does help get over the, 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 the difficult times, right? It, it makes it more human. It's not just a, I'm paying you to do X and you're doing Y. It was a conversation. It's always a conversation, which I love with a partner. Well, it's That's great. Cool. To hear. And, and yeah, you don't ever want to um, be in a situation where, at least from the Aviano side, we're afraid to tell you that we recommend a different approach. Um, because hopefully you've hired us to be the expert and, um, those are hard conversations. So, um, the relationship is absolutely key. You're uh, extremely reasonable and you are uh, listening to our, our advice. Um, and, um, you know, making, creating compromising or talking through issues or solving problems, um, is not as stressful as it would have been if we did not have that you know, that trust, that friendship and uh, level of understanding that we were able to build. So on our end, we truly appreciate that as well, of course. And I, I think we should say as well to enhance that is that that built, relationship has been built during tough times where we can't actually meet physically. You know, we've only met a few times physically, but it's more this video conversation, texting conversation where we know how to contact each other. We know that we all have different stresses and all different priorities throughout the day. Um, but we've built that relationship in a very tough time where we've understood each other that things are competing for our time and you know everything's time sensitive, everything's cost sensitive as well. Yeah, for sure, sir. But also it plays into your experience building other systems. Like you understand uh, the concept of MVP and you were not afraid of it. Uh, you also understand the concept of uh, you know, done is better than perfect. So you were willing to go live uh, with a subset of the remaining of functionality um, in right before or during actually COVID um, to uh, step aside and uh, be able to observe uh, mm -hmm. your customer behavior and learn from it. And uh, some of the priorities that we first um, were, you know, understood kind of shifted, right? And of course, the the B2C, B2C is one of those. It created an opportunity, but there were also, you know, some minor uh, changes that we, um, you know, observed and that were able to implement uh, post uh, COVID. Absolutely, absolutely. Because no platform's perfect, so <laughs> we have to make accommodations, and we've done that very well, I think, between us.